It's your favorite YouTuber and welcome to this video. We'll get ready to turbo charge your front end skills today because we are actually going to slice through the various and cover the various HTML topics today. This is it. This is literally it, guys. This is it. This is the ebook that I've been working on. It's called Free JS Essentials. So think of HTML as the building blocks of the web. It's not just about writing code, actually, it's about crafting experiences for the users. Crafting user experiences. Let's decode the alphabet of the web together. Uh, the challenge is real in a, and in a digital sea of developers. Uh, how do you rise above, guys? Not just with flashy tricks, ooh, I know CSS, but with solid bulletproof HTML know-how. Stay tuned as we unpack the toolbox of HTML from elements to attributes and set you up for that standout developer portfolio that I'm trying to create for you guys, man. Please watch my videos. First up, HTML elements. Think of them as the foundation of your web page, like you see here. The P element, the HTML P element, the header one, the body uh, tag element, the headers, and we also have the script tag. All these HTML elements, think of them as the foundation of your web page. Without them, you're basically trying to build a house with no bricks. Now let's talk about browser support. Ever wonder why some browser, some websites actually look broken? Look broken, sorry, on your phone. Well, not today. We are making our HTML bulletproof across all browsers. Attributes are next. They are like secret sauce that adds flavor to your elements. Global attributes, they are universal. Event attributes are your interactive bodies. They make your web pages respond to, to user action. Think of them as handshakes between your site and your visitors, just like you see here. When, we, when you click subscribe, then it says you are sub to iSec. Let's go! Then you also have colors. Colors bring life to your design. We will dive into the color names, ensuring you will never have a dull moment or a dull website. Uh, an audio video is time to get multimedia. HTML isn't just about text and images, guys. Let's pump up the volume and play with sound and motion, which we don't have over here for now, <laughs> but we'll definitely create it later on. Uh, canvas is your canvas is your digi digital canvas. Whether it's graphics, game development, or just cool animations, we're going to sketch out ideas right into the browser, guys. And the DOM, the document object model, might sound complex, but it's basically just us, yeah, just us manipulating HTML and CSS through JavaScript, this functional programming language. I think it's object. Whatever it is. And uh, what else? Yes, that is. It might sound complex, but it's actually just about connecting the dots that are, yeah, that I just explained. Making sure that every part of your website is uh, interactive and and the functionality is up to par, and it actually works. And it, the DOM basically makes uh, makes sure that every part of your website talks to each other seamlessly. Uh, we also going we also going global with language and country codes that you see here above. Uh, HTML English. Um, <clears throat> so it's all about speaking your audience's language, literally. HTTP messages are the signals of the web. They are behind the scenes heroes that make sure your website and the server are on the same page when we request something. Imagine imagine looking at a menu at a restaurant and you ask the waiter for something. That is a HTTP, HTTP request in the digital world. You ask for something and it might return successfully. You get a, a response 200 or you might get an error 404. Well, the waiter apps, uh, it's, yeah, I guess it's just going to take a little bit longer. The waiter slipped and he accidentally uh, broke something, broke glass. So it's going to, yeah, it was a failed response. And for those pixel perfect designs, we'll nail it down with PX to EM conversion, ensuring your site looks sharp on all devices, guys. Don't forget about the CSS that we have lined up here. Please, how could you ever do that? Responsive media queries, man. And yeah, guys, also try to search for uh, yeah, guys, also try to search for HTML short codes, uh, that shortcuts that you can use uh, because they are basically cheat codes for speed, speed production. We will so we will wrap up by supercharging your your workflow. Your workflows you can actually write HTML like a pro. Imagine you have a, an empty HTML file, then you can basically just do this, and you will have this document right here, and you can quickly just write out anything that you want. All right, guys, let's rock and load. Let's rock and go. Uh, by the end of this video, you have become an HTML hero, ready to tackle the web with confidence. And that is about it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like this video and comment down below. See you in the next one.